to play in bookstores before. And it's my favorite because I really love, love books and especially used books. They're so fun and interesting and you can open up this book and so 
something, some piece of paper that belonged to the person that had it before and it fell out. There's a whole extra story in there. Plus, sound, great. plus books sound great. Yeah. There's also that. Nothing better than books sound really. Um, um, so, uh, uh, we, so many of you all know our story. Um, we, we've had lots of stories over the past year. And one of them being, um, in September, our little town where we live in Lyons, Colorado, um, got massive flooding. And we, um, our house ended up uh, getting like seven feet of water in it. And um, the recording studio in the house um, had walls blown right through and all our stuff that went down the river, except for our good instruments and ourselves in our pajamas. Uh, but um, uh, so we, we travel, been traveling around a whole bunch since then. And uh, one of the places we went to stay um, was my, my folks' place where I grew up in a little town called Waterford, Virginia. And uh, it's, it's a great little town. I loved it. It was ideal to me when I was growing up because there was lots of um, artist um, parents with wild, crazy kids and a big community of us kids. We'd run around and played and got into all kinds of trouble and played music together and um, went out to uh, the waterfalls outside of town uh, at the edge of town and uh, got into, did all the kinds of good, bad things and uh, uh, came back and pretended like nothing would happen. And, and we, we, it, was, it was a great place to grow up and, uh, and it was idyllic. And um, a lot of the folks, all the kids I grew up with, I think also thought that. And uh, then it was um, vindicated finally uh, for me in uh, uh, my late teens because it came out in Time Magazine. Um, reported one of the 10 best places to grow up in the United States, Waterford, Virginia. So um, that was, yeah, of course. But then um, when I, nowadays it's sort of become, and, and most of all those people have moved out of Waterford, and it's become sort of a shell of what it once was to me. And uh, But my parents still have a home there. And um, all those wonderful locations and wonderful homes that I grew up around are still there. So I have reminders. But I wrote a song about it. So when we were there, we stayed there for two months this winter when we, uh, we're running around being vagabonds, <coughs> and uh, I was reminded of what it was like. So here we go. One, two, three. <laughs>
one thing we were hoping to have with us on this trip, but we don't, was um, the new city we've been working on, which is almost done. We're going to go home. We head home tomorrow. We're going to go home and finish it and uh, bring it back to these parts sometime this summer. But that song we just played and this next song uh, on the new CD. And this is called The Moon Song. My love, I'm lying down to the view When time will hide And there we lay The stars were falling from the heavens The dark night was bright as day And the dark night It's not. 
Thank you. 